If you like using Share Factory Creator Packs but get frustrated creating a project on one Creator Pack and not being able to add text, stickers or transitions to it from other Creator Packs, then this video is for you. So if you don't know, Share Factory has 18 Creator Packs, each with their own unique text, stickers and transitions, but you can only use those text, stickers and transitions and you can't use those from other Creator Packs in that actual project. So the only way around it is the method I'm about to show you now, but there are a few important things you do need to know about this method which I will explain later but first let's show you how to get around this so let's assume we want to use the text from the cartoon creator pack and transitions from the 80s synth wave creator pack for example okay so let's show you how to do this starting right at the beginning so we're in video editor new project and we choose whichever creator pack we want to use in this case cartoon creator pack and then we get rid of all the pre-ticked boxes here and just go to most recent and choose whichever clips we want to add to our project. I'm just going to choose these two and press square to start. It's a good idea to name the project just so you can go back to it at any point if you want to and then you literally just create the project exactly how you normally would how you want it to be. For the use of the video and just to make it quicker for you I'm not really going to do anything. I've got two Fortnite clips which are quick kills and all I'm going to do is just add the text that I want very quickly just to um, show you that we're using one creator pack and then we'll show you how to use the other one. So I'm just going to add this really quickly. Okay, and we're back and I've just added I love Fortnite to this clip, which you can see now. And so that's the cartoon text font, which I wanted to use. So we are obviously in the cartoon creator pack. And if I wanted to add a transition, I would only have the option of all the usual transitions and the two cartoon transition options here. Okay, so assuming we've got our project exactly how we want it, what we want to do is export it. So we push the triangle button to export the video to the gallery. And when we get to this screen, just push share later. Okay, so that's going to save it into your gallery. So then we can just come out of this. So push circle and then go to save project and exit. And then all we need to do is start a new project. So push cross on new project and then choose the new creator pack that you want to have. In this case, it's uh, the 80 synth wave, which I've chosen. Untick everything like we did before. Go to most recent and find the exported clip and then push square to add it and then rename the clip and then there we go and actually i didn't untick all of the boxes so you just go to delete that clip if that happens to you okay so the project is one whole clip now so if you were only changing the creator pack to change or add a different sticker or text then pretty much you just go ahead and add the sticker or text from the options in that creator pack and then complete the video as you normally would upload it or whatever so if that's the case you are pretty much done and you've had two different creator packs in one project but as we want to add a transition on this one we do need to find the point where we want to add a transition and go to split clip and split the clip accordingly so when you're on a split clip it does ask you to confirm so you just confirm that and then we now have two clips which allows us to add a transition so we pushed across add transition and then we went on to the AT synth wave in order to add this transition so I've just chosen that so before we go on to the important notes to make this is the transition from one creator pack and this is the font from the other creator pack so it can be done Okay, please do hit the like button if you got this far. Thanks very much. So there's three points to remember when you're using this method. Okay, first thing to think about is on the first creator pack, try to complete as much editing as you can, as it will be harder to edit the individual clips once you have exported them. Secondly, if you're using music or commentary on your projects, then try and do that last of all if you can, because they will be harder to adjust if you need to later on in the project. Thirdly, before you start recording a project, it's best to check which creator packs you actually want to use, and that will save you a lot of wasted time and possible recording if you plan it for a few minutes before you start recording okay on screen are the videos to watch next i hope you found this useful please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already and thanks very much for watching and bye